invite children and parents to come to the start of your Hope for Kids training. Create a festive atmosphere and decorate the area where you will be teaching. Welcome everyone. Welcome to Hope for Kids. In Hope for Kids, we greet kids or team leaders this way. High five. Okay, that's high. High five. High five. Sorry, high five. Okay. And then if there's a high, then there's, there must be low. Low five. Okay. And then baby five. Mm. Okay, let's do that. Okay, let's do that. The Bible verses children learn during the scripture games are foundational to hope for kids. These verses support the gospel pathway. The primary objective of the scripture games is to provide activities that children enjoy while they begin to learn the verses. You want children to understand that God's word is powerful and that it can be fun to learn Bible verses. Have posters of the verses prominently displayed and prepare a game for each verse. See the examples in the teacher's book, but also think of local games that children love to play. Try to relate the games to the truth of the Bible verse or to the stories in each unit. Only son that who so ever believe in him may not perish but have everlasting life. Believe in the Lord Jesus and you will be saved. Then review Proverbs 3, verses 5 and 6. Proverbs, Proverbs 3, 3, 3, 5 and 6. 5 and 6. Trust in the Lord. Trust in the Lord. With all your heart. With all your heart. And lean not on your and lean not on your own understanding own understanding in all your ways in all your ways acknowledge him acknowledge him and he will and he will make your path straight make your path straight that's very good. The craft or take-home item for this unit is the power pack with all the Bible verses. You will find a power pack in the craft pages in the center of the activity book. Cut it out and make two folds. The power pack is to remind us that the Word of God is powerful. <laughs> 